tough game today. I mean, it was a 3-0 scoreline, but um, probably the scoreline didn't actually reflect uh, the game. How did you feel about that? Yeah, the no, you're dead right. We um, we struggled today. We didn't play great. No, Rangers, mm. to be fair, mm. should have got something out of the game yes. probably. But, yeah, look, we, we were 1-0 for a long time, and the second one wouldn't come. But, you know, we had four or five missing today. So they threw the young kids in there, but at the end of the day, that's no excuse. We didn't play that well. Um, and to be fair, they're tough to beat in. Mm. Yeah, it's a tough um, day. They threw a lot at you, particularly in that uh, middle of the second half and yeah. towards the end of the first half, but you must have been pleased that your defence held up pretty well. Yeah, we defended more than we attacked it uh, for probably 10 minutes there, 15 minutes, and to be fair, they had more of the ball than we did, so, you know, my guys, um, it will take three points away yeah. from home, but at the end of the day, the yeah, Leno's boys deserve mm. something out of that, probably. Mm. Uh, three points is, uh, as you said, you'll take that, but it was um, that's a pretty important three points as well, because yeah. it's obviously on the road, and it is tied up the top, I and mean, obviously City are, are running away at the minute, but yeah. there's a long way to go. Yeah, look, we just uh, want to keep winning, you know, what's our first trip away in the league today, mm. so it was interesting to get away, we had a player you can get on the bus and miss the bus, so we were delayed a bit, so, you know, and you don't, you know, you run out of time, you come up and it's like, go, 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 yeah. but, um, yeah, Lonnie, Lonnie obviously keep racking the points up, so, mm. We've just got to make sure we stay in the mix up, give ourselves every opportunity. Yeah. Um, Lino, tough result, 3-0, because really the uh, the game didn't reflect that. Do you, do you sort of see it the same way? Oh, the second half, yeah, the second half, we, we really deserved to get a goal or two, and, and we didn't deserve the, the last couple, I didn't think. But anyway, the, the first half, I thought we were one step behind. Olympia were knocking it around really, really well. We were chasing our tails a bit so we're going forward and miss a couple of passes and next thing you know you've got to run all the way back so so we were um, tiring ourselves out basically doing nothing in the first half and then the second half we we changed it up a little bit and decided we were going to run at Olympia and, and see how they liked it and we went okay. Um, it's always tough when you've got to respond after a pretty early goal again it was 10 minutes in and, and, and they got got a good start but were you happy with the response particularly sort of the latter stages of the the second half into the second definitely definitely i was very proud of the way the boys fought out the second half um i guess uh, what didn't help us as well was we, we had a couple of injuries nick mm -hmm. back and hurt his back before the game he, he played probably 60 minutes and another day he wouldn't have um we had a little bit of cramp one of our centre halves and um, Mitch Jones got a knock on his ankle so there were three substitutions I had to make. I had to put a 16 year old boy at centre half and, and um, I think he did quite well. We got caught out that last goal but um, you go, you're chasing the game, you're, you're going to get done right there. You're um, getting pretty close to halfway during during the season but um, overall you're not far off the mark. You, you, you're feeling proud of the way the boys have, have, have looked at the first nine or so games of the season? Yeah, you're definitely right there. We, um, the guys are, aren't getting flogged by any means mm. and, they're, and they're very, very competitive. They're playing a good brand of football. Mm. They're defending as hard as they possibly can, but, but some of the talent we're playing against is uh, a, little bit, a little bit hot for us occasionally. And um, so if we don't have that mentality for 90 minutes every week, we'll probably be at the wrong end of a couple. But, but uh, I guess at the end of the year, if, if we keep fighting it out like this, um, we'll, we would have, we'd be very happy as a coaching staff. The players are, are devastated, but um, but I mean, what are you meant to say when you go in? And, and you, there's not much you can really say to them. So you, I guess, say sometimes saying nothing's better than anything. I guess.